Hello and welcome back and thanks so much again for viewing. I'm your host Salty and this is Salty Sportsman. On this episode, we are out here with Clint. Clint, where are we at? What are we fishing for? Uh, we're about 30 miles off Inglewood, Florida and 100 feet of water and we're targeting yellowtail snapper, hopefully some mangroves and whatever else wants to bite our line. He says we're targeting yellowtail. I think we're gonna get into some flags. Stay tuned in, this is gonna be another exciting episode right here on Salty Sportsman. Nice yellow tail right there. Start off the day right. Get him up, get him up. It's a big yellow tail. Big yellow tail. Get him up. Oh! Oh yeah. Yeah. Is that the cobia? No, big Buddha. There he is. Yeah. That's, that's the size fish we're after. <laughs> right. Oh, oh, subscribe to Salty Sportsman. <laughs> I recommend that you subscribe to this channel because we're doing cool stuff like this all the time. Salty. <laughs> so, so, so. <laughs> so what you do is you take a, like a medium heavy rod, uh, 4,000, 6,000 reel. You got some 20 pound mono. Uh, tie a swivel on, connect it to a 15 pound Yozuri disappearing pink fluorocarbon, little teeny jig head, 16th of an ounce. Take the shrimpy, right through the horn, and toss it in. So I'm just slowly feeding line, I'm just letting it sink, and try to make it look as natural as possible, just feeding. And then you just wait until the line starts flying off the reel, close the bail, and wind. Go. Look at him following it. Holy oh, mackerel. Bro, that's a good fish. That is a great fish. There he goes. Fish on. Yep. Smaller one. He might measure, but I'm still gonna throw him back. Yeah, he's 13, 14, or he's like 14, I keep him. I'm not sure how big he is. Check out that one that Clint just caught. <laughs> There's so many yellowtail down here right now, it's insane. I just dropped my bait in right on top of them. They're just all through our chum line right now. Oh, it's not a no, the yellow tail. There's a after it. There's a after it. Oh! <laughs> that was crazy, dude. And I got that right on. Oh. Dude, I just got the CUDA like literally nose to nose with the camera. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, look, look, bro. Wow. What a save. Almost had my, my yellow tail. Look at that. Nice. That's a good one. That's a good one. It's, it's pretty bad. It's pretty awesome because here we go. I would say like the first 
something chasing him. There's a oh, it's that shark. Double header, bro. Double header. Someone's chewing on some bubble gum. <laughs> it seems like they're getting bigger and bigger. You notice that? Yes. Yeah. Like the first four or five were like mediocre. I was like, eh, yeah, like... Yep. That's true. Now they're getting. All right, guys. So what we're doing here is we've set up on the spot. We've uh, created a really nice chum slick, um, or I should say, Clint did. He has a special concoction he puts together. And what we're doing is, is uh, I, I, I'm fishing a 4,000 outfit, um, a pin battle, and I tie my main line with an Albright knot to a 12 pound. Um, this is 12 pound fluorocarbon leader and then to this little jig head. And what I do with this little jig head is Clint showed me that we just hook it right through the horn. Right up top there through the horn, just like that. And that's gonna, that's gonna really create a nice natural approach. And, and what we do is we basically just cast it out. Just gonna cast it on out. And you just let, just keep on feeding it line. You just want to keep on feeding the line. And when you get hit, you are going to know it. You are going to know it. Because it's just going to peel line off of here, off the, it's just going to peel line off the reel. And when it peels line off the reel, you just want to simply flip your bail over and pull them up quick. Because if you don't pull them up quick, the sharks are going to get them. Is that pretty waiting. accurate? That is accurate. <laughs> Sharks are Goliaths. They're waiting. Sharks and Goliath are down there waiting for a yellowtail snack. Get him. Get him. Oh, whoa! <laughs> Did you guys see that? We got to give a shout out to my baby Lauren for the sandwiches. Thank big, you. Love big ya. shout out. Thank you. Mmm. <laughs> Good stuff. <laughs> it's a heck of a day when you're throwing them back like that. Yes, it is. You got that right. We limit it out. Limit it out. Literally throwing 16, 17, 18 inch fish back now. We're just switching gears a little bit. We don't really know what we're going to get into, but we're switching gears. What are we doing? You don't know either, do you? We're going to go to some hard bottom, hopefully get in some red grouper, gag grouper, and whatever, whatever what else happens. wants to bite. Exactly. Whatever pulls the drag. We're out here having fun, guys. <laughs>